Yo, what's up there everybody? This is McCree coming at you with another video. Have another McFarlane um, sports pick update. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started here. Uh, this is David Wright. This is from the series 28. This is the collector's level, the bronze. It is number 758 out of 1500. And actually, this is my son's uh, McFarlane figure. He's a Mets fan. And we just happened to be at a mall at an outlet. And uh, they had a TJ Maxx. And we happened to just go in there. Because sometimes TJ Maxx does have McFarlane figures in there. And so uh, we just happened to see this. And how much was it? It was... I know the price. There you go. Six ninety nine at TJ Maxx. So um, he wanted to get this, so we ended up purchasing this for him. And like I told you, I I really don't do baseball. He he collects Mets um, figures, so this was a great pickup for him. So we was happy to get that. Now the next one I have here is a regular Clay Matthews from series 28 and of course this is, is um, the regular figure this is not the collector's level as you guys know the throwback one is the the retro jersey is the um, collector's level and it's numbered to 900 as you can see here it says 500 to 1000 but uh, Matthews is to 900 alright so um, we got this one okay the next one I got was the NBA series 20 this is Kevin Durant collector's level figure and it is numbered 970 out of 1000 and what level is this? This is the silver level. And as you can see, though, I definitely want that Griffin um, All-Star uniform. And I de um, really, that's the only really one I want, to be honest with you, and of course in the rose. So, but I, I do have the rose, which I'm about to show you in a minute, but definitely want that Griffin if I happen to see it in the store. But yes, but this is Kevin Durant's uh, collector's level. Okay, next one we have here is the Dirk Rose. This is his regular figure here. And I'm getting that. And to be honest with you, Dirk Rose is, the regular is selling like crazy too. I mean, try to go. I had to end up getting this off of eBay because when I went online to other places, they were selling out quick. So, got it for $14.99. And the next one I got is Derrick Rose Collector's Level. This is his road uniform. And this is the bronze level. And it goes to 2000 And I got this one from sportsfigs.com. And it is numbered 199 out of 2000 sportsfigs.com they sent me um, one before this one but they had it packaged in, in one of those slim um, um, United States Postal Service boxes where the packaging up here was too wide so when they put it in there they kind of they forced it in there and it bent the size up pretty bad so I gave them a call and told them that um, I received the package damaged and so they told me to send it back and they would send me out another one so I'm thankful the sportsfigs.com did that for me and I ended up getting a lower number too as well so I was happy about that okay the next one here I got is the Andre Johnson's collector's level and he is numbered 534 out of 2000 
And I ended up getting this from a sports memorabilia shop that I know this guy, um, he was selling it for 20 but he only sold it to me for $15. So I got a great deal off of that. So I was happy to get this because this was one I wanted as well. And of course, on here, like I told you guys, I want the Vic, the Matthews, and the Newton. So hopefully I can uh, find those in stores. Okay, now this box right here that I have, I got this from Toys R Us. It just came in today. And as you can see, one thing I have an issue with with Toys R Us is that they don't pack this stuff well. As you can see, it came just like this. Now just imagine if it was um, something heavy was sitting on top of it or it was you know to the side there's there's no protection here so I mean I don't know why Toys Us does that they don't protect these boxes man they don't put fragile on or anything but uh, these came out okay but they have um, going to be opened anyway and I see the first one here I got is Blake Griffin this is his regular and the reason why I also order from ToysUs.com is sometimes they will give you a uh, collector's level figure. So I went ahead and ordered Griffin online, praying that I would have got the uh, the collector's level with the All Star jersey. But unfortunately, I only got the regular. So, but anyway, I'm happy about it. I think this is my favorite figure out the whole series here. So I was happy to uh, get this. As you can see, you know, kind of put that back in place, but it's going to be open anyway. But still, I mean, what if this was a collector's level figure and the package was damaged because of the way they packed these boxes? So I got that. Also, I got uh, Carmelo Anthony's. There is no collector's level figure for him, but there is an exclusive from him, which I will be getting soon. Got that also I got the regular Kobe Bryant I was hoping that at least I would get him in the collector's level as well but I got this so and last but not least I got John Wall no collector's level for him so um, that is it that is my most recent um, pickups and purchases that I um, got so um, I will be getting some exclusive figures in on next week so I will be doing another video of showing you guys my um, exclusives that I picked up and uh, hopefully man I'll um, this weekend I'll be going out so hopefully I can find a collector's level somewhere out there you know, especially the Blake Griffin all-star level um, collector's level figure so uh, wish me luck guys again thank you guys for uh, you know viewing my videos thank you for um, some more subscribers that I recently um, received and I thank you guys for that I don't know how many it is I didn't check but uh, I have received quite a few more subscribers so I really truly thank you guys for subscribing to my videos I'm happy to show these to you all so again I uh, look for another video of one next week showing you my um, exclusive figures and until then see you guys next time peace